Hello everyone, I am Ghulam Abbas. I hope you guys are fine and doing great. In this video, I am going to show you how you can create the macOS Monterey ISO file here in Big Sur. You can use any version of the Mac you are interested or you are using currently. So the very first thing is that you need to have the codes and then there is also the issue of the macOS itself. So you have to download the macOS itself. Currently, it is in the beta version and I have already downloaded the install assistant package. Uh, you can have a look here it is available and i have already installed it and now you can see the uh, installer app is now available in the applications directory so you need to have this too and then uh, the, the next thing is that you have to launch the uh, c sorry the uh, um, terminal and then you have to simply copy and paste these commands uh, now copy and then paste this command will create a dmg file uh in the temporary location and then the file name will be monterey and then the size will be 1300 uh, 350 now if i have to multiply sorry multiply 13 multiply by 1024 it will be 1312 it will be 13 gb basically in uh, in mb now i have uh input there 1300 uh, 350 because there will be additional storage uh and uh yeah that that will be required so once you did that section press enter on the keyboard okay what is saying that hdi util only one okay there's the command there is an issue with the command basically you have to yes now you have to put a space there so basically you have also to remember that this is case sensitive uh, if anything goes wrong, everything will be wrong. So let's just hold on. Okay, now the monitor.dmg file has been created in the temporary location. So the second thing is that we have to mount the uh, DMG file we just created. And then, uh, okay, now you can see that it is mounted here. And the second, the third thing is that we have to basically kind of make it bootable so to do that one just uh, type sudo on the terminal and then go to the applications directory uh, right click on the macOS uh, itself and then choose show package contents and then after that content open up and then resources and now you can see create install media you have to simply drag it to the terminal and then once you did the section you can close this window and from here you have to copy the rest of the commands in other words you can also type them if you are interested but i am not simply a fan of it a fan of it so there's also the issue of the volume name you have to change the catalina to monterey remember as i said before it is case sensitive m o n t e r e y okay that's totally okay now let's just simply press enter now it is going to yes it is boot, making bootable the dmg file we just basically created that hold Okay, now that the disk has been bootable, now it is copying the files of the macOS into the um, thing, the, the, the DMG file we just created before, earlier.
okay now we can see that currently it has been bootable everything has been settled down okay now let's just go ahead to the temporary location and let's see what is going on up there okay now we need to change the dmg in other words the bootable whatever it is uh to monterey in other words we need to deattach it currently and then paste the command here uh, remember that all the command everything is right hdiutil volumes install macOS. i think is it something must be wrong with this command okay just let's just go ahead just as i thought there is wrong with it so we have to simply hdi util d attach d e t a c h and then i think we have to simply drag this one here yep as i thought and then press enter again not found hdi util d attach williams install make os 12 slash beta not found um where is the issue the issue the issue okay hdi util d a t s e h d attach now what there is uh, let's just simply drag it again not this time i have written something wrong here util util okay now what the attach work not recognized hdi util okay det okay now it is done hdi util d tag volumes install so now we can see that uh, it is basically simply there was the matter the issue of the uh, drive location so let me i have to simply copy this one later it should not i am going to provide these codes for you uh, so you should not face any other issue the way i am facing yep so and now finally we need to convert the dmg file to 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 a cdr by the name of montre.cdr on the desktop so copy this one and you have to paste it here uh, i think everything is okay this time yep now you can see that it is currently reading the disk of montre.cdr Okay, it's going to take a while then once it is done we are going to convert the cdr file into the dmg file sorry the iso file okay now everything is done now we need to convert it basically to the iso file so you can see yeah. mm, control v and paste sorry command v desktop montre.cdr okay now that is moving i think i am missing a work if it did not work then we need to do something about it so oh, okay now it is moving basically it is on the desktop uh, yep it is done this is how you can basically create the macOS uh, iso file so i hope this was helpful for you uh, if you had any question let me know in the command or in the site basically the site is also known as intizum.com you can visit it there i also provide uh, everything every command there you should not face any problem uh, there just as i faced here so let me again explain everything uh, one by one for you so you should not face any problem in other words any issues 
while you are creating the ISO file okay so <clears throat> you can see that the very first command creates a DMG file in the location of the temporary so you can visit the temporary uh, folder by going to there and simply type tmp and then slash go you can see that we have created this dmg file and then the next thing is that you have to basically uh, mount the dmg file you just created with the second command you have to remember that the name this one is the name and then here is the size of the disk that you are creating remember you have to also put the same layout that you are going to create this one and then you have to put the same name for montre.dmg and then at the end volume name montre and then there is also the pseudo thing most of the people who are basically creating their own uh, iso file they are commenting that uh, we are facing error the error is this section many of you are facing this a problem you have to basically uh, just simply type sudo on the command prompt I mean the terminal after that one you have to go to the applications directory uh, right click and then let me I have to show you practically so you should not face any issues just there right click show package contents contents resources and then you have to simply drag this one on the terminal once you did that one it will be till this section after that one you have to copy the rest of the command remember that is Catalina you have to change the Catalina to Monterey just the name you put it up there and then you have to simply deattach this section remember uh, maybe in the future the uh, another version will appear the command won't look like this so you have to simply type this to command section and then uh, okay this is wrong something is wrong with this command now it's right uh, you have to simply type this two section and then simply drag the uh, volume which was just basically mounted in other words the files have been copied there and then finally you have to convert the dmg file to in a cdr file and finally you have to move them move the cdr file to the iso file which will be basically uh, which is basically the command. So this is how you can simply create the macOS uh, The macOS ISO file inside the macOS. So I hope you like this video Don't forget to subscribe like or comment. So till next time have a nice time and goodbye